News MasterCard plans to turn cars into mobile wallets. MasterCard's in-car payment technology allows drivers to pay for things like fuel, parking, and drive-through orders directly from their vehicle's dashboard or infotainment system without having to use cash or a physical payment card. It uses tokenized card credentials securely stored in the vehicle to enable contactless payments from behind the wheel. Payments can be authenticated with biometrics like fingerprints or facial recognition built into the vehicle. It integrates with merchant payment terminals, and apps to facilitate transactions from inside the car. It aims to provide a seamless, secure, and convenient way to pay for vehicle-centric services without needing to get your payment card out. Beyond payments, it could enable in-vehicle commerce like ordering food slash goods for pickup or delivery directly through the car's display. The main benefits touted are improving safety by reducing driver distraction from handling payments, as well as adding convenience and time savings to everyday car-based purchases and transactions. However, adoption relies on merchant partners integrating the technology. ICNCO LTD has developed an innovative autonomous drone charging station called the eDronic Charging Station that can be installed up to 15 meters high. This elevated placement protects the station from vandals and allows drones to easily land and dock while in flight. The eDronic Charging Station addresses the restricted range and flight time limitations of air drones caused by their small lightweight batteries. It provides a solution by offering automatic charging boxes mounted on poles. When a drone approaches, the the box doors open, allowing the drone to land inside. After landing, the box closes to protect the drone and charging platform from precipitation. Charging is done wirelessly at 220 volts, 20 amps, 400 WTS, or 500 WTS. The station is available in two sizes, 54 by 42 in and 59 by 73 inches, to accommodate drones of different configurations. This enables automated drone operations by providing charging without manual battery replacement going beyond current autonomy limits. The charging station can be strategically placed in remote areas like mountains, along roads, or fields to facilitate continuous drone operations such as surveillance and rescue missions without worrying about battery life constraints. For maintenance, the entire station can lower down the pole it is mounted on. The Hydrofoil Ejetski Flyway is an exciting new project by David Vukovic, who has already made a name for himself with custom-made e-foils and electric hydrofoil accessories under the brand Flying Rodeo. Similar to the e-foils, this stand-up water motorcycle features an electric motor and uses a propeller drive rather than a jet drive, which is why High Fly Water Sport refers to it as a water scooter. There are two models available, the Classic and the Premium. However, specific differences between these models have not been publicly disclosed yet. Unlike an e-foil, which relies on weight shifting for control, the flyway is operated using a handlebar that controls a rudder. The handlebars include a display showing the rider's speed and battery consumption. Additionally, a Bluetooth speaker is built in, allowing riders to listen to music via their smartphones. The flyway is designed to be easily dismantled for transport, making it a convenient option for those who want to take their jet ski on the go. The current price for the flyway is €14,500, plus VAT, and shipping. Notably, the initial batch of Flyway units sold out within just two days, indicating strong demand. Two, the Flyway seems to blend the concepts of an electric watercraft, hydrofoil design, and a stand-up motorcycle-style riding position into one unique personal watercraft. LA-based startup Eli Electric Vehicles is launching its flagship Zero Electric Microcar in the U.S. market later this year. The Zero is a tiny two-seater electric vehicle designed for urban-slash-city driving, with a starting price of just $11,990. If your daily drive is only a few miles, and you don't have school runs or carpools to worry about, smaller makes a lot of sense when selecting a city runabout, while not suitable for highway driving. Classified as a low-speed vehicle or neighborhood electric vehicle, 
vehicle NEV, in the US. The diminutive zero measures just 8.2 feet long, 88.6 by 54.3 by 64.4 inches, making it perfect for navigating tight city streets and fitting into small parking spaces. Its ultra-lightweight composite body weighs only 760 pounds. The Zero is a two-seater electric vehicle powered by a 6 kilowatts rear-wheel drive motor, allowing for a top speed of 25 miles per hour ideal for urban-slash-suburban commuting, gated communities, campuses, and tourism. It offers two battery options, an 8 kilowatt hours LFB pack for up to 60 miles of range per charge, or a 12 kilowatt hour pack adding an extra 30 miles of range. The Zero comes in two variants, a standard micro EV and a plus version with extras like heated seats, Bluetooth, and a backup camera. Charging takes 2 to 4 hours at 220-240V using the included home charger or optional type AC cable. If you're looking for an affordable, eco-friendly ride for short distances, the Eli Zero could be a great choice. Boston Dynamics has unveiled a completely redesigned and fully electric version of its iconic Atlas humanoid robot, representing nearly 15 years of effort according to CEO Robert Plater. This new Atlas offers significant upgrades over its predecessors in terms of strength, agility, precision, and real-world applications. Key improvements include longer limbs, a straighter back for increased mobility and reach, and a distinct swiveling head for better situational awareness. Perhaps most notably, the new Atlas has transitioned from a hydraulic system to an all-electric design, making it more efficient and suitable for everyday tasks across industries. The renewed Atlas boasts enhanced whole-body mobility and manipulation capabilities that push the boundaries of what is possible for humanoid robots. While previous versions focused on search and rescue, this Atlas is designed to take on the most boring, dirty, and dangerous tasks in sectors like manufacturing. With its combination of greater strength, dexterity, precision, and an electric power source, Boston Dynamics aims to leverage the new Atlas for a range of real-world applications. The dynamic robot represents an exciting development that could impact lab environments, factory floors, and even our daily lives. cycling often gets you around the city much faster than a car. As a result, more and more people are regularly using bicycles for commuting to work and for everyday journeys. However, when the weather turns and it gets cold and rainy, many of us prefer to use cars and other means of transport. The whip is designed as a functional weather enclosure for cyclists, providing protection against rain, wind, and cold, ensuring year-round comfort. The whip offers pure wind, cold, and insect protection, even at speeds exceeding 45 km per hour. Its integrated lens ensures optimal visibility, keeping cyclists dry and comfortable in all weather conditions. Cyclists can stay over 90 to 95 percent dry and warm with the whip thanks to its built-in lens for visibility, aerodynamic design for reduced wind drag, and compatibility with most city and touring bikes. It provides robust protection against rain and cold winds, making cycling a viable option regardless of weather conditions. Learning robust autonomous navigation and locomotion for wheeled-legged robots is an interesting and challenging topic in robotics addressed by researchers from the Robotic Systems Lab at ETH Zurich. Wheeled-legged robots, also known as hybrid robots, combine the mobility advantages of legged robots with the efficiency of wheeled robots, making them suitable for various terrains and applications. This study proposes an integrated system combining adaptive locomotion control, mobility-aware local navigation planning, and large-scale global path planning for wheeled-legged robots. It introduces a hierarchical reinforcement learning approach for autonomous navigation and locomotion of wheeled-legged robots, enabling robust navigation and adaptability to different terrains and environments. The findings support the feasibility of wheeled-legged robots for applications like last-mile delivery and beyond in urban environments, with the potential to transform logistics systems by improving operational efficiency and adaptability.
Is the sleek and unique appearance of an aircraft the first thing that attracts you? If so, then the picture of the stationary multi-mission VTOL, vertical takeoff and landing, UAV must have deeply caught your eye. This professional drone, launched by France's stationary company, boasts an impressive set of specifications that make it an ideal choice for various tasks across industries like surveillance, mapping, and surveying. With a maximum takeoff mass of 45 kilograms, the stationary can carry a hefty 15 kilograms payload and offers an impressive flight autonomy of 90 minutes. Its kerosene turbine engine powers a main rotor with a turning surface diameter of 2.5 meters, allowing it to reach speeds of up to 90 kilometers per hour and cover a distance of 30 kilometers. Equipped with a three-axis brushless gimbal, this VTOL drone ensures steady vision during flight, while its unique coaxial reversing helicopter design allows it to take off and land without a runway, providing flexibility in different terrains. However, like any technology, Technology, the stationary VTOL UAV has its drawbacks. The VTOL system adds weight, potentially restricting the payload capacity, and it consumes more energy, impacting operational costs. Additionally, the increased complexity in multiple engines can make it noisier than conventional drones. While the aerial shooting market continues to boom, with various businesses rolling out competitive products to feed the hungry consumer public, the stationary's unique and sleek design, coupled with its impressive performance specifications, make it a standout choice for those seeking a versatile and capable VTOL drone solution.